Hello and welcome to this week's Carrie Connects. I am psychic medium Carrie Muggs, and each week I pull a card from a deck to let you know what's coming up for the week and the signs and symbols to watch for. This week we are using The Enchanted Map by Colette Byrne Reed. I don't think we've used this one very often. It's um, different cards throughout, so it's got like a compass on the back, on, on, on the back of each card with little hearts, which I love. And then each card is like a different section of um, throughout the world and so like a different kind of like a journey that you're going on and this these cards are like your compass of where you're gonna be out so I kind of I love that because it just makes me feel like we're always on this journey and I love that these cards have different places in the world different sceneries and different you can see it I'm not the best but there you go okay so hold on Protecting your treasure. Wow, that's kind of a that's kind of a one this week, right? Protecting your treasure. This and the numbers are three 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 and nine nine nine, which means three 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 means your guides and your ancestors are watching over you, and nine 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 thing means that um, there's you're closing one door to open another, so you you're leaving something behind, so something good could come forward. Um, and protecting your treasure. So treasure doesn't always mean monetary things. It doesn't always mean money. It can in this case, but I kind of feel like, see how she's resting, and last week was about resting. She's resting on top of her treasure. I really feel like this is um, protecting you, protecting your gifts, protecting you. It can be, if you feel like your financial your financials are in danger, then I would take an extra care to like look at them this week or protect them if you feel like somebody's out to get you or things like that. You know, maybe if security issues come up with some of your banking and stuff, just protect that. But I honestly feel like this is about protecting you and protecting your spirit and protecting your gifts and being confident in them and knowing who you are. And I really, I really believe that sometimes you have to protect your gifts because other people put them down or put you down or other people don't believe in them or other people think it's stupid or think it's crazy and that's been happening a lot lately. I think there's lots of people coming into their their gifts recently and and their intuition and a lot of people are putting them down or thinking they're not real and just because they don't think it's real doesn't mean it's not. It's very real for you. So protecting your treasure, whatever your treasure is, if your treasure is your family, if your treasure is your spiritual gifts, if your treasure is, I mean, all of those are treasures, financial treasures. Be protective over you this week and all the stuff that you feel is important to you. Protect yourself. A lot of times we protect others or we protect um, other things, but we don't protect us. So make sure when this week that you are self-protecting. If you're protecting spiritually, just wrap yourself in white light. Ask for protection from your guides. Um, that will help a lot too. If you're an empath and you're going into crowds, imagine that there's like a white clo cloak over you when you're entering the crowds. But mostly protect your gifts and protect your mental health and protect your sanity because you are awesome. And if other people don't think so, then that's okay. You need to protect you and your, your well-being. So, so protect your treasure this week. And that can mean a lot of different things, but I'm but you go with your intuition. This is your homework this week. You figure out what your treasure is and do what you can to protect that. Whether it be your relationship, whether it be your children and family, whether it be finances, whether it be your spiritual gifts, whatever you feel that your treasure is, you need to take extra precautions to protect it this week. And that doesn't mean anything bad's gonna happen. It just means that you need to watch over it and you need to make sure that nobody chips away at that and makes you feel bad. Even as a mother of young kids, if there's somebody out there that thinks you're not mothering right, then get rid of them because there's no, there's no manual on how to mother right, right? We're all doing the best we can. So whatever your treasure is, protect that. Protect not from danger or harm. Protect it from other people's opinions, okay? So what we're going to have as far as signs and symbols this week, that's our, there's a lot of signs and symbols. Um, mushrooms down here and then uh, off, obviously a treasure trunk 
and then we have an umbrella right here and on top of the umbrella is a bird so we have and then on let me see what that is okay so hold on there's something on the treasure box that i can't it's a crown it's a crown because you are a god and a goddess you are awesome so royalty a crown you are royalty so a crown so we have an umbrella a bird a crown a treasure treasure trunk and i think that this is gold right here on the side and it's shiny and then mushrooms and um three and nine three and nine are the numbers three 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 and nine 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 so so figure out what is important for you this week what really holds your heart this week and protect it protect it from others opinions protect it from what others think about it or protect it and even if you feel like it needs more protection then protect it stand strong be in your authenticity love who you are and um, it'll all be good now when you see these signs this week also too I think a compass would maybe be a sign because you're going in the right direction I love this because it makes you know that you're going in the right direction you're right where you need to be okay remember that um, I think that this is awesome because you're right you need you are right where you need to be on this journey and three 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 nine 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 and I kind of lost track of what I was going to tell you before, but it's all good. So um, there you go. Oh, when you see the signs and symbols, see, I knew it would come back. This means that Spirit's reminding you, reminding you you're going in the right direction, you're on the right journey, and it might be a little bit of a reminder to protect. Protect your spirit. Protect your treasure, whatever your treasure is. Protect it. Put a little bit of a, a guard up. So Spirit's going to be with you this week. Watch for the signs, and remember that I love you so much, and you already have everything you need inside of you. See you next week.